morning welcome to the weekend welcome to saturday the 13th of february excuse me january 2024 to peace through the word daily devotional ministry of peace in the valley lutheran church benson arizona in cochise county in the united states a lutheran church missouri synod congregation i'm pastor ron york of that congregation so good to be able to welcome you this morning on this weekend uh, no matter where you're chiming in from from around the world we really appreciate it, and we thank you immensely. My brothers and sisters, on this Saturday morning, Dr. Martin Luther is going to share with us the subject of the picture of love, and then Sarah Young is going to talk to us about how Jesus says that we should um, look at each day as an adventure. And so I pray that both of these subjects will bless us, inspire us, encourage us, and give us genuine real peace as we come together in the name of the Father, the Son, in the Holy Spirit. Amen. So, holy God, holy and most gracious Father, have mercy and hear us. So, my brothers and sisters, on this Saturday morning, taught by our Lord and trusting in his promises, we are bold to pray the prayer that our Lord taught us, the Lord's Prayer. And so, together we pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. We profess the Christian faith by using the words of the Apostles' Creed, so together we profess. I believe in God the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and he sits at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. So Martin Luther is going to talk to us on the picture of love, and he uses his text of 1 John chapter 4, verse 16. Within that passage of Scripture, we have the following. It says, God is love, and whoever abides in love abides in God, and God abides in him. A lot being said there in just those few words. So let's see how Dr. Martin Luther unpacks this truth for us this morning. <coughs> he says, if we were to talk for a long time about how love is a high noble quality in the soul, the most precious and perfect virtue of all, as the philosophers and teachers of works do, that is all nothing compared to what he loudly pours forth, saying, God himself is love, and his essence is nothing but pure love. If someone wanted to paint God accurately, then he would have to find a picture that is nothing but love, since the divine nature is nothing other than the fiery furnace and ardor of love, which fills heaven and earth. In turn, if someone could paint and picture love, then he would have to make a picture which is not artistic or human, not angelic or heavenly, but God himself. So the apostle can paint things here in such a way that he makes out of God in love just one thing. He does this to coax and draw us through this noble, precious, and delightful picture, all the more to strive also to have love for one another and to be on our guard against envy, hatred, and dissension. Good word there from Dr. Martin Luther. I pray that will be transformational for us this morning. And then Sarah Long, Young is going to tell, talk to us about looking at each looking at our each day as an adventure, carefully planned out by your guide, 
Instead of staring into the day that is ahead of you, attempting to program it according to your will, be attentive to me and to all that I've prepared for you. Thank me for this day of life, recognizing that it is a precious, unrepeatable gift. Trust that I am with you each moment, whether you sense my presence or not. A thankful, trusting attitude helps you to see events in your life from my perspective. A life lived close to me will never be dull or predictable. Expect each day to contain surprises. Resist your tendency to search for the easiest road, excuse me, route through the day. Be willing to follow wherever I lead. No matter how steep or treacherous the path before you, the safest place to be is by my side. <coughs> Amen. So we cry to you, O Lord, in the morning our prayers come before you. Restore to us the joy of your salvation and uphold us with a willing spirit. Our mouths are filled with your praise and with your glory all the day. Every day we will bless you and we will praise your name forever and ever. By awesome deeds you answer us with righteousness. O God of our salvation, the hope of all the ends of the earth and of the farthest seas, bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me, bless his holy name. He redeems your life from the pit and he crowns us with steadfast love and mercy. Hear our prayer, O Lord. Let our cries come to you. We continue to pray. We thank you, our Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have kept us this night from all harm and danger. And we pray that you would keep us this day also from sin and every evil, that all of our doings and life may please you. For into your hands we commend ourselves, our bodies and souls and all things. Let your holy angels be with us, that the evil foe may have no power over us. Amen. So let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless us, defend us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. My brothers and sisters, again, thank you so much for chiming in this morning to Peace of the Word. Pray it has blessed you today. And so I convey all of God's blessings to you in abundance and wish you all tremendous blue skies. <laughs>